What if I told you that one man had the power to change the world forever, but someone stopped him? Nikola Tesla, the genius behind AC electricity, radio and wireless energy. But his most mind-blowing discoveries never saw the light of day. After his mysterious death in 1943, the US government took everything. His research, his notebooks, his most powerful secrets. But why? What was Tesla working on that made the government move so fast? And more importantly, were his secrets truly lost? Or are they still being used today in ways we were never meant to know? Stay with me because this is not just a story, it's a puzzle. And by the end, you might see the world in a way you never have before. So let's begin. Friends, Tesla dreamed of a world without power lines, no electricity bills, no energy crisis, unlimited power for everyone. He built Warden Cliff Tower, a giant structure designed to send energy through the air. He claimed the Earth itself could transmit electricity like a giant battery. But before he could finish, his funding was cut off. J.P. Morgan, one of the richest men of his time, had invested in Tesla. But when he learned about free energy, he asked one question. Where do we put the meter? Tesla had no answer because there wouldn't be one. Morgan pulled the funding. Wardenclyffe Tower was shut down and destroyed. Did they stop Tesla because they feared his ideas or because they feared losing control? Tesla once spoke of a weapon that could end all wars. He called it the Death Ray, a device that could shoot a beam of energy across vast distances, strong enough to destroy aircraft, armies, even entire cities. But he never sold it. Why? Some say he feared what the world would do with it. Then, in 1943, Tesla was found dead in his hotel room. Just hours later, the US government took all of his papers. They claimed his research was useless. But if that's true, why did they move so fast? Did Tesla really create a weapon so powerful that even governments feared it? And if he did, who has it now? Friends, Tesla was not just working with electricity, he was experimenting with time itself. In 1895, Tesla was testing high voltage electromagnetic fields when something strange happened. Witnesses say he was shocked and for a brief moment he froze. Tesla later described the experience. I saw the past, present and future all at once. Does that sound like science fiction? Maybe, but modern physics now suggests that time is not as simple as we think. Some scientists believe electromagnetic fields could alter time perception. So, was Tesla onto something much bigger? Was he trying to unlock the secrets of time itself? And if so, could the government have taken his research to develop time-altering technology? What happened after Nikola Tesla's death is one of the strangest mysteries in history. On the night of January 7, 1943, Tesla was found dead in his room at the New Yorker Hotel. Just hours later, government agents rushed in and seized everything. His notes, his research papers, his blueprints, over 80 trunks filled with his life's work. But here is where things get even stranger. Later, when reporters and researchers asked about Tesla's files, the US government gave a suspiciously simple answer. There was nothing of real value in them. Nothing of value? This is the same Tesla who pioneered radio, remote control, x-rays, electric motors, and even the foundation of modern wireless technology. This is the man who once claimed he had discovered a way to transmit 
unlimited energy wirelessly across the planet. And yet, suddenly, the government decided that his life's work was insignificant? That sounds like a cover-up. And if Tesla's discoveries were truly worthless, why did they rush to seize them in the first place? Why not leave them untouched to be studied by future scientists? It gets even more suspicious. Decades later, researchers uncovered something shocking. Some of Tesla's missing papers had resurfaced in Yugoslavia. Yugoslavia at the time was a socialist country with a complicated relationship with both the US and the Soviet Union. If Tesla's research ended up there, it raises even more questions. Who took them there? Was it an inside job? Did someone within the US government smuggle them out? And here is something even more chilling. Some experts believe his papers might have ended up in the hands of foreign governments or secret military projects. During the Cold War, the US and the Soviet Union were in a race to develop advanced technology and powerful weapons. If Tesla's research contained even a hint of something revolutionary, it could have been priceless. And here is where it gets even more mind-blowing. Many of the things Tesla spoke about, wireless energy, directed energy weapons, even potential anti-gravity experiments, line up perfectly with classified government projects that emerged decades later. Could this lost research have been used in secret military developments? Could Tesla's ideas have been far ahead of his time, so much so that even today they remain classified? One thing is clear, Tesla's ideas were powerful enough to scare governments, both in his time and possibly even today. And if his research is still out there, hidden in the depths of classified walls, what might they be using it for? So now I have to ask you, do you believe Tesla's greatest inventions were truly lost to history? Or were they secretly taken? hidden away and maybe even used in ways the world is not meant to know. What if Tesla had succeeded in giving us free energy? Would we still be paying massive electricity bills today? What if his death ray was real? Could it have changed the course of history? Or is it already in use, hidden in classified military projects? And what about his experiments with time and space? Did he unlock something beyond what we are told is possible? I want to hear your thoughts. Drop a comment below. I'm reading every single one and I love seeing your theories. And hey, if this video made you think in ways you never have before, do me a favor. Hit that like button, share this with someone who needs to hear it and make sure to subscribe. Because here on Engineering Made Easy, we don't just ask questions. We uncover the mysteries of science, the universe, and the secrets they don't want you to know. Stay curious, keep questioning, and I will see you in the next one. Thank you.